when we were up at Logan Pass and there were about 15 bighorn rams that kept trying to come into the parking lot and Gracie was able to keep them out. 150 pound border collie against all those bighorn rams. She felt pretty good about herself. My name is Mark Beal and I'm the Natural Resources Program Manager at Glacier National Park. And over my shoulder there is Gracie, the bark ranger. Uh, she's our wildlife shepherding dog at Glacier National Park. Girl, come on. Gracie is a seven-year-old border collie. You know, she's just a smart dog, really driven dog, always wanting to, to please, to do something. And we like to call her our, our go-anywhere dog. But when we get outside, you know, if there's wildlife that needs to be moved and she is aware of that, then she's definitely focused and very energetic. Gracie's title is Wildlife Working Dog. The media kind of latched onto the Bark Ranger tag because it's kind of catchy and cute. And the work kind of came about from research that we did up at Logan Pass, you know, where there's a lot of mountain goats and a lot of bighorn sheep in close proximity to a lot of people. A lot of park staff and visitors would comment, you know, what they were seeing visitors do around the sheep and goats. You know, it was very unsafe. You know, people get too close to the wildlife and that wildlife is still wild and unpredictable or the animal could react in a defensive manner, which could result in harm to the person or could even result in the death of the person. Also, this leads to the likelihood of us having to remove one of those animals from the population. And I noticed that other parks like Waterton Lakes National Park, that's our sister park in Canada, they use border collies to move deer out of the town site to prevent bears and mountain lions from coming in at night and threatening people. I thought, you know, we have a border collie and we have a situation that's similar to that. So I wonder if we could use Gracie as a, a new tool in the toolbox to deal with this issue. Okay, leave it. Good girl. What makes Gracie unique is that she's an employee-owned dog. And both Gracie and I, you know, went through a temperament assessment and personality assessment and we both passed. Yeah. So what we did then was we uh, got Gracie signed up for a 10-week training program. Gracie, easy up. Gracie, down. The first day when we went up there and there were six bighorn sheep rams in the parking lot. I don't know if it was exciting for her, but it was exciting for me. Within a matter of 20, 30 seconds, Gracie had the sheep out of the parking lot. They were 40 yards away and they stayed away. If it were just me out there, trying to keep people away from wildlife. You know, they might look at me and ignore me. Or if I wanted to talk to them about, you know, being safe, if I saw them doing something risky, you know, the chance of them listening or staying focused was pretty low. But with Gracie, you know, she's a, an attraction. And so when I have her out there, I find that people definitely do listen and, um, you know, do pay more attention. I'd say her relationship's kind of mutualistic. I mean, I think she brings out the best in me. I like to think I bring out some of the good in her. That's pretty much the long and short of it. <laughs>